Today we're going to be talking about the energy dependence of our beam on x-ray scatter. So for instance, if you increase your KVP, will the scatter go up or will the scatter go down? I'm Brian Nett from HowardEologyWorks.com. Stick around to find out. Remember, in general, scatter leads to degradation in image quality, leads to an overall haze added in the background of the image. You can see this is an image with scatter, and this is an image where an anti-scatter grid has been used to reduce the scatter amount. The KVP dependence, if we remember, for our X-ray imaging, there's two interactions. There's the photoelectric interaction, and then there's Compton scattering. And depending on the energy of those photons, the likelihood of the different events will change. So we talked about this when we talked about the fundamental X-ray interactions. And if we look at the relative contribution, we show in green here the photoelectric, and we prefer photoelectric interactions. And then we show in red the Compton. All these degrade the image quality in our images. So what we see is energy of the beam. This is if we think about a monoenergetic beam, like a given photon of that energy. As that energy of the beam increases, we have a higher proportion of Compton. As the energy decreases, we have a higher proportion of photoelectric effect. So this is why, one reason why, you want to use lower energy photons as long as they can make it through the anatomy of interest. So you can see here, if you, for instance, double your energy, you're going to a significant change. You could go from having 60% of your interactions be photoelectric to having 60% of your interactions be Compton. So just a high level takeaway, what we wanna remember is as we go to lower KVP, we get decreased scatter effects. As we go to higher KVP, we get increased scatter effects. Again, this has been Brian Nett with HowRadiologyWorks.com. Leave a comment below. Let me know what your favorite or least favorite part about x-ray scatter is. And head on over to HowRadiologyWorks.com backslash scatter and download your free one-page PDF cheat sheet about the directionality for scatter with all the given technical parameters that we're going through in these videos. Thank